and welcome. I'm David. Welcome to Space Tech Tips. Today we're going to be talking about Star Spikes Pro 4. It's a great uh, Photoshop filter plugin that you can add and adds, you know, those dis diffraction spikes that uh, can add a little bit extra to your image. Okay, so we're on the website here at Pro Digital Software. We're just exploring the site a little bit. I uh, you can look at the site whenever you like, but uh, here's some sample images that this site gives. Okay, so here it's before and then after the image. Again, this is before and after the kind of things that uh, you know finishing uh, that you can do the picture again after before. All right. So those are some of the things that you can do. You can try before you buy. You get a 15 days free. If you like that kind of finishing diffraction spikes uh, that come naturally to some images, um, you can try it out. If you like it, you can buy it. It is $37 though. Um, so it's up to you whether $37 is worth it or not. But uh, uh, that's that. So let's go over and switch to Photoshop. Okay, here we have one of my old sample images no diffraction spikes at all nothing like that okay i'm gonna go over once you if you do like it you can download it install it and then uh if you have photoshop up make photoshop up make sure to restart photoshop uh you want to go to go over here to filter it'll be down here in pro digital software star sykes pro 4. Okay, here we go. Here's like a default sample uh, template, I suppose you could say. Um, there's a lot of things you do. You can change the quantity. Let's say I wanted even more star spikes. Change the intensity of the spikes. Make them much more intense or less intense. Just for the sake of the demo, let's make them more intense. You can change the length. You can make them take the whole page if you like or less uh, number of points let's leave it at four for now change the angle uh, sharpness the spread spread function so you have it kind of spread out at the end or or less let's keep it more uh it defaults to a hundred percent change the hue if you like uh you can also do like a, a kind of a rainbow uh, rainbow intensity so you can change the frequency and intensity so you want like that more of a rainbow look to it okay add a little bit rainbow there okay and then you could like the, actual, the secondary effects so like the the star itself so you can make them blue more or less you know flare more or less and then uh, there's like a ringing effect that uh, if you like that look you can add that in I'm just gonna leave that off and that's that so once you're done uh, you can go ahead and hit OK and then there you go that's how it looks like a little bit closer yeah and you can just uh, you can do whatever you like it's kind of more of a zoomed out look on it okay well if you like what you saw, please click like and subscribe. And if you like the tool, good luck with the tool. This is Space Tech Tips. Thanks.